Oh, hello again. Just a very quick update on this um, screwdriver antenna. That's the bracket I made for it. These have all been bonded with earth straps into the van. Ferrite on everything. Um, now one thing I did find very strange, the top bracket I made to give it some stability, this originally had a metal clamp that went round there onto there and um, as you saw I, I put it on my tower and clamped it and it was all working perfectly so I clamped it to the van with this clamp round here and the SWR was bloody terrible I couldn't figure it out so I took that, this off and the clamp tested it again it was fine uh, oh dear me so anyway what I found was it just didn't like the metal clamp around this pole so I got another piece of this nylon and made it thicker and then just put a thread in there and screwed it directly into there and clamped it on so it can't go anywhere but that's working much much better now and I found a plastic bottle that fits perfect over the thing so when it's going up and down it's perfect so there you go I'll just show you quickly in the van The only thing I've got left to do now is um, is the actual um, power switch to send the to send the um, thing up and down. So right, that's on that antenna. Let's just go to oh, it doesn't matter. The second one is the SWR. One, two, three nothing showing and that's on most of the band to be honest uh, let's go to this 520 530 nothing g0sqi test that's pretty good all over 10 meters obviously the further oh excuse me the further down the bands you go the narrower and narrower it gets so, so there you go that's um seems to be working quite good so what I've done is um, I took the the little light out the roof and passed all the cables up through there and the remote for the amplifier is down here and that turns the amplifier on or off the um, Amatron 500 in the in the roof it's up here inside so it's good works Cheers for now. See you later.